Hi, I'm Joanne. Um, do you believe in miracles? I don't mean the really big miracles like raising people from the dead or crossing the sea or a burning bush all the time or walking around in a fire. I'm talking about the miracles that happen every single day that we tend to ignore or pass off as luck or coincidence. Um, in my mind, there is no such thing as a coincidence. It's a God incident. And he puts those things in our path so that we can recognize his constant faithfulness in our lives. How many people have ever prayed for or asked for prayers for traveling mercies? And they've gone to their destination and come home without a problem. Have we ever thought to thank God for answers to those traveling mercies? The little things that we take for granted. Um, I can remember going on a trip and forgetting something and coming back and that five minute time kept me from being in an accident that happened at the very intersection that I would have been passing through. We talk about these kind of things and think, oh boy, were we lucky. I don't believe in luck. I believe that God gives us opportunities. We have these miracles every day if we start recognizing and paying attention to them. And in this day and age, these miracles become so important of reminding us that God is faithful and God is trustworthy. His love never ends. And he is constantly sending us love miracles. Um, this week even, a friend of mine reminded me that of something that had changed my life actually. I'm an introvert, believe it or not. And her comment was, you're an introvert because you're afraid of being judged. And it changed my whole attitude of how to interact with other people. That to me was a miracle. And it should be to others. We need to start recognizing those miracles. A vaccine for the pandemic is a miracle. But so is somebody taking a meal to somebody who is sick or saying a prayer for somebody who is sick or sending a card or making a phone call. Those are all little miracles in somebody's life. And so I would like to call you to attention, to pay attention to those miracles that happen every single day and to participate in them. Become a miracle to someone else. Say the words that God puts on your lips and you're afraid to say, speak them out. They may be exactly what somebody else needs to hear. And the card you send may cheer somebody in, in a not so happy day. The other night, I was not in the best of moods and I was walking and I looked up and all of a sudden there's this glorious sunrise, sunset. And I'm thinking, God is still God. He is the artistic creator of our universe. And we need to start participating in his miracles here on earth. So will you join me in prayer? Lord, I pray today that every one of us has a God incidence in their life, has a God appointment in their life where they can participate in your miraculous doings here on earth. Lord, we want to further your kingdom here. We want to participate in that activity. Help us, Lord, to be a miracle to somebody today. And Lord, we thank you for all miracles, seen and unseen, that we aren't even aware of yet. We thank you, Lord, for your activity in our lives. Lord, be with us always. We pray for your peace, your hope, and your love. We ask this in the precious name of Jesus Christ, amen.